What is happening guys? Bob here, Rides Auto Sales. Got a couple of people asking for a beautiful a video. <laughs> this beautiful 66 rested on our showroom floor. So uh, make sure you read through the specs, details on this. They're gonna be directly below this video. Actually above this video, I switched it up. So make sure you read through all those specs. What I'm gonna do right here is just have my buddy Sheldon give you a cold start, hear the engine run, Give you a nice walk around, let you hear the exhaust, and give you a walk around the outside and interior as well. Have Shelton go ahead and turn the key. Go ahead and jump in the back so you can hear the exhaust. jump on this engine bay while we have the hood open so you guys can take a peek. <laughs> Horn works as well. Thanks, Sheldon. As you can see, guys, that 396 rests beautifully in between these fenders as it was meant to be in there. Uh, satin finish on the firewall and inline uh, inner fender wells as GM intended it to be. Dressed up nicely, chrome everywhere, set of headers. Underside of the hood is detail painted just as well as the exterior of the car. Go ahead and close this so you guys can see everything in full frame with the hood closed. Cruising across the front, you're gonna see how well this bumper presents itself, nice and shiny all the way through. Headlights are as clear as clear can be, no cracks, condensation buildup, anything like that. As stated in the ad, all lines are beautiful from fender to hood, hood to fender. Once again, on this side, fender to hood, you can see all the way through, lines are the same, look great. Cruising down passenger side, come down to your level here, you're gonna see nothing but smooth contours, nice crisp lines. Disc brakes up front. Panel gaps from fender to door are nice and spot on. Panel gap from door to rear quarter, nice and spot on. Then you're gonna see this body line coming all the way through. Lines up well from panel to panel, no door sag or anything like that. Go ahead and pop this door open. Nice clean door jams all the way up on the inside. All rubber on this thing is new. You're not gonna see anything cracked, weather checked, anything like that. Just nice and clean all the way around. Striker plates unpainted. Once again, all new gaskets all the way through. Bottom of the door is nice and sharp all the way down. Rocker panels nice and solid all the way through. Interior is beautiful. As you can see, we'll get a little bit more into that as we jump over to the driver's side, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and close the door here real quick for you. As you can see, closes very, very well. No need to slam it. Badges are all new. Nothing pitted, anything like that. Now, cruising across the back, once again, you're gonna see a nice clean bumper that presents itself very well. Tail lights are in great condition as well. Nothing weather checked, anything crazy like that. Um, gaps from trunk lid to rear quarter, all nice and spot on, all the way across. Cruising down driver's side, and come down to a nice level here so you guys can peek on down. Once again, nice smooth contours, crisp lines. All of these body lines line up great from panel to panel on driver's side as well. Jump down here. You can see rear quarter to door. Panel gaps nice and spot on from door to front fender. 
Nice and spot on as well. Once again, new 396 badging. You see a nice, beautiful hood. Glass on this thing is all as clear as clear can be, guys. Easy to see through. Trim is all nice, new. Excuse me, it's not new. Uh, you know, you jump into a lot of year one stuff, it's gonna be, you touch it, it'll dent. Um, this looks to all be original. That's all been polished very well, if not re-chromed. Um, rear window is as clear as clear can be as you're gonna see. A lot of times in restorations, you know, people skip out on rear windows. This one has been replaced, easy to see through. Go ahead and jump on the interior here after we show you nice clean door jams once again. Jump down here and show you the bottom side of these doors, nice and sharp all the way through. Once again, rocker panels, nice and solid. Unpainted striker plates all the way around. Original Vintag still intact. All new gaskets on driver's side as well. Jumping onto the interior. Interior has been fully replaced. Go ahead and show you the back seat here first. Back seat is as clean as clean can be. It looks to have never been sat on. Carpet's all new, free of any rips, tears, stains, anything like that. And you see dome light works. Go ahead and kill that so we can show you this nice, clean, tight headliner. Door panels, all hardware works as it should. Jumping on inside, you're gonna see nice clear gauges, easy to read. Addition of a Sun Pro Tack. Center console is in great condition. And a clock that works, look at that. Cruising up on top to the dash, you can see a nice clean dash, no UV damage, no cracks, anything like that. All visors are nice and stiff. You're not gonna have anything flopping down in your face when you're driving. Just a nice, beautiful car, guys. And go ahead and close driver's side door for you here. Once again, you're gonna see no need to slam this thing at all. One door is gonna close it. Jump back, move a couple of chairs, get this into full frame for you before we close. Guys, that is our beautiful 66 resting on our showroom floor. This restoration is super nice, guys. They did a really good job with it. Car drives like a dream and it would make anybody happy. Uh, once again, this is Bob Rides Auto Sales. Phone number and email address will be directly below this video. If you have any questions, comments, words of wisdom, anything like that, feel free to shoot me an email, give me a call. I'd love to help you with your next purchase from Rides Auto Sales. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.